my name is uh, Rodi Huendekar. I came about two months ago to Rojava from the United States. I'm an American. Uh, before this, I was a student and I studied philosophy, and I came to join and to support and show solidarity for the Rojava revolution, precisely because uh, I study philosophy. Uh, philosophy is about asking questions, and I think that the Rojava revolution is asking important questions and offering uh, more compelling answers than the rest of the world. The rest of the world is fighting over which borders are the best to contain or divide different ethnic groups. The rest of the world is asking questions about the domination of women by men, uh, and the rest of the world is trying to dominate one religion over another, and people like Daesh, like uh, the Turkish state, like Assad, ask themselves how they can succeed in that domination. And I see the Rojava revolution as motivated by alternative questions and answers, and instead of seeking domination, it seeks cooperation, and it's, this is captured in the philosophy of uh, Serak Apo in democratic confederalism. After having read what Apo wrote, I planned a year ago to come to Rojava, uh, to join the YPG, and after uh, another year of studying, I finally made it here. I went to an academy here for one month to study both uh, language, ideology, and how to fight. And now for a good portion of September, me and my Hevals have been here in Raqqa. Uh, the front is not far away, uh, and you can hear perhaps uh, the, the fight as it continues. Hopefully soon uh, it shall be complete and we can continue to show solidarity, to stand behind and to stand beside uh, the Rojava revolution, uh, so to stand behind and to stand beside our Hevalnos in the YPG and YPG. Um, and with that, I'd like to invite anyone who sees this to take seriously the project that's taking place here, to take seriously the possibilities that this is offering as an alternative to the domination that other groups see around the world. With that, BG Yepegeu Yepeje, BG Sarakapo.